So about those fender flares, I went with Tiger. The bolt-on look, but kind of hard to see. They're super bulky. They're four inches wide. So I still got four inches from my truck, which left the tires inside the fenders. And I didn't like that look. Now it's a whole lot of protection for my truck. A whole lot of protection for the guys behind me when I'm driving, especially just leaving my driveway right here. It has rocks, right? And I said, nah, I'm, I didn't like that style. So what I went with, went with the Air Design OEM Fender Flares. They're practically just stuck to the truck. Sticks out, uh, I think it was three quarters of an inch from the actual truck. They're OEM because they fit around the mud guards. You don't have to take off mud guards to install them. It even comes with an extra wind lip. Here's a wind lip right here. And this is exactly where I had those rock chips. This is at the angle where rocks fly off out of your tires. So it gives you a little bit of extra protection. It also protects the cars behind you. And it has a nice look to it. My tires still stick out from the truck. Still looks good. Uh, no more rock chips. Those ti that tiger one that I have in the, in the shed, in the old shed, I'm just gonna go ahead and just give it away. Uh, someone who has a Chevy truck that wants that bolt-on look but for me, it didn't work. But these do have a nice little look to it. Because you got the matte black. Matte black. Matte black. Matte black. Matte black mud guard. So it has a nice little look to it. And I went with, this is the matte black, smooth, textured uh, fender flare. That's on there. It has a lip. I see the lip it goes all the way around. Oops. So easy to install. It took about a minute, two minutes a tire, or two minutes of a, a wheel well. That's pretty much it.